So I'm going to show you how to set the scale or calibrate image J. You see I've got image J open here and the latest version is called Fiji. It's the same program. And I have an image that I opened and this is a piece of a ruler that I cut and I stuck um, in my zooplankton counter and the ruler has to be at the exact same place as you know whatever you're taking an image of. If it's too close or too far then the scale is going to be off and of course you have to be at the exact same magnification if you're doing this under a microscope. And I know that this ruler was in millimeters so the distance between each of these little marks is one millimeter and I'm going to use that to set the scale for image J. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the plus sign a couple times and I'm going to zoom in to get real um, precise and I'm going to choose the straight line and so I want to be as close as possible so I'm either going to go from like the edge to the edge or the center to the center so I think I'm going to go edge to edge and I'm also going to try and keep it straight and perfectly perpendicular to these the more careful I am here the more accurate my measurements so I'm going to click and drag and you see I'm going from one edge of one mark to the other edge of the other mark and I'm as perpendicular as I can be and I'm going to go to analyze set scale and here's the distance the length of that line in pixels which I know is one millimeter And then I'm going to go ahead and click global, which means that every other picture that I open up will use the same scale. But again, this only works if they were all taken at the same magnification and the same distance from the camera. And so when I hit OK, now the scale is set. And if I want to do a measurement, let's just measure a couple of these others. So I'm going to go from the center here to the center. That should be one millimeter right? If I hit control M to measure this line, um, that didn't work for some reason. So I'm going to go to analyze measure. There we go. And you see the length 1.017. So um, if you look closely, I'm not quite in the middle of this one. So I my line actually does look like it's a little over a millimeter and that's what image J is telling me right here and that's how I set the scale for image J